reaction video. We are reviewing Buxom Full Force Plumping Lipsticks. They launched six different shades. I got my hands on four so we can try them out together. And this collection is really, really special because it's 90s nudes. So all of these lipsticks are new nude lipsticks. And you guys know me, if you've been following my channel for a while, girl, you know I love a good nude lipstick, okay? So I couldn't wait to get my hands on them and just see, you know, how it feels on. How sheer are they? Are they glossy at all like these lipsticks? Or, you know, or are they matte or what? And how does it feel on the lips for it to be plumping at the same time? Because I've never tried a plumping lipstick. So I'm hoping that they're pigmented. I hope you guys enjoy today's review. As always, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos just like this one. And let's jump on it. The first lip shade we're going to go ahead and swatch on it is called Supermodel. Love the name. I feel like it definitely goes with the theme of the 90s because it reminds me of like all the supermodels models that were out at the time, like Kate Moss. Um, so on the website, really quickly, I do want to mention that it talks about how these lipsticks are supposed to be long-lasting, non-chalky, or ash so that is something you know to keep in mind while we're trying them out I'm gonna go ahead and swatch supermodel really quickly in the back of my hand so I can show you how she looks and she's a rosy nude which is so pretty look at that you guys I can't wait to try her on so you guys let's go ahead and try on supermodel Watch. It is called a Fly Girl, and she is a peachy nude beige. And I'm going to go ahead and swatch her in the back of my hand. You guys, I love the packaging, although it's just, you know, silver. <laughs> but around the two of the lipstick, it has, like, little lips on them, so that is really cute. I personally really love, like, the little extra touch that they made doing that. So, okay, you guys, let me go ahead and swatch her. Very, very pretty. Love this color. I feel like it's going to look so pretty on. <laughs> so here she is. So you guys, let's go ahead and try on Fly Girl. Now for Dream About, she's more of a toffee nude, okay? And I personally love toffee colors. <laughs> So I can't wait to swatch her on. So far, you guys, these lipsticks are gliding on really creamy, really nicely, but still not too sheer and obviously not too matte at the same time. So it's a really pretty lipstick, and I really like that. So far on the back of my hand, I don't feel like a tingling sensation at all. Um, so that is something that I'm really happy about. I don't want it to, like, you know, be that impactful that fast. <laughs> So here is, what is this one called? Dream Boat. Very pretty. Love the undertone to it. So you guys, let's go ahead and try on Dream Boat. Now for the last and final lip color we're going to go ahead and try on. It is called Heartthrob and this is a light warm nude lipstick. So let me go ahead and swatch it for you guys. And ooh, very, very pretty, you guys. Love this lipstick already. You guys, this collection is so me in every single way, so I'm so happy. <laughs> Here is the swatch. Very, very light, but still very pretty. So you guys, let's go ahead and try on Heartthrob. about these plumping lipsticks because I've never tried you know this consistency before <laughs> and obviously I love the idea that it's nudes so let's go and talk about that really quickly love all of these nude lip shades I think they nailed it and now I kind of wish I got all of them <laughs> so I can try them all out equally um, but I think they're all really pretty shades are all really creamy they all have a really pretty consistency to them they're really pigmented I love that and they're not too like shiny and oily. They're the perfect lipstick, like the formulation of it. As for the plumping agent, I definitely can feel it. Let me tell you, once I applied it on, girl, it's in. <laughs> it doesn't hurt at all, but it definitely feels like a tingling, fresh, minty sensation, which is fine, especially right now during, you know, the summer months. It's hot outside, so anything that's gonna give me, you know, a refreshing, cooling feeling, 
I'm in. <laughs> so I really like that. For $20, are they worth it? I think if you're a big nude lipstick lover and you have, you know, a special place in your heart for the 90s, I think this would be something, a collection for you to, you know, see if you like any of the shades and try out. I do love how pigmented are they. They're really cream and rich in the cons consistency of it without being like too glossy which I really like because it just feels like a regular normal lipstick but it has like a refreshing feeling to it and obviously I love a nude so girl you got me sold right there so I really like them I love the packaging of it too as well for these lipsticks I mean it's pretty basic but I really like it I like that it's just different than you know a black packaging tube of lipstick you know what I mean so I really love it and I love the little detail that they have around the tube of the lipstick that it has the little lips all around it it's such a pretty little touch and you know just reminds you that it has a little plumping agent to it um, but yeah do I feel like this is gonna plump I love to make them look you know nice and juicy I don't know you know I feel like these things definitely do a little something but not to the point that it's gonna be like super noticeable difference <laughs> you know what I mean maybe if you apply this over and over and reapplying every few hours to refresh maybe but I really don't think it's gonna make us look like you know really you know change the shape of our lips completely but this is really nice because I love the refreshing feeling to it is there a scent to it let me go ahead and smell it really quickly there really isn't a scent actually there is a scent I think it's like a light vanilla scent which is which is nice I'm okay with it you can't really even smell it to be honest unless you get like that close to it like I did right now so that is something to consider if you guys have any questions please comment down below as always please don't forget to like share and subscribe for more videos just like this one and I'll see you guys all in my next review I love you guys so much bye